No more federal assistance for people on unemployment. That's the harsh reality now that unemployment programs that resulted from the pandemic just ended over the weekend. Investigative reporter Chris Horan joins us now on how this is just making a bad situation even worse. Yeah, Congress approved several programs coming out of the pandemic and they have ended now and they're going to affect different people in different ways. One of those programs provided an additional $300 a week. Another, known as PUA, helped people who were so-called gig workers who were denied traditional unemployment. Those two safety nets now gone. Katina Devon of Virginia Beach was relying on PUA until March when it stopped. That's when her payments stopped, even though she still had eligibility. She worked as a cook and dietitian at a healthcare facility until the pandemic had wiped out her position. Devon says she's owed about $9,000 by the Virginia Employment Commission, and trying to reach them only adds to her frustration. Sometimes the phone will be like, well, ho, you are the next caller. You have one caller ahead of you. I could be on the phone for like 30 minutes, and I'm like, okay, I know it don't take 30 minutes to deal with one call. And it says that every time. I said, that can't be possible. Ahead at 5.30, more on the backlog of cases facing the VEC and why that has likely put the agency in violation of a court order. Chris Horn, 10 on your side.